Hi guys, welcome to this vlog. This is actually from July 26th. I know it's so long ago, but literally I have been so crazy busy that I have not been able to edit this. I know that's a lame excuse, but trust me, I have literally had no time. So I'm finally getting around to editing it and uploading it. This is actually from like the day I got back from my Georgia road trip. So I'm really sorry for the delay on this one. And that was like when I had long hair, you know. So anyway, I hope you guys enjoy the vlog. Let's get started. Good morning, everyone. Welcome to today's vlog. I'm back home as you can tell I've got my little lights on back here I don't know if I've ever vlogged with these but I really love them I just put them up but anyway right now I have a very busy day today I have to film a bunch of random stuff and I actually have to go out looking for some worms to dig up yeah you heard me literally worms to dig up it's for a video I know it's crazy and don't worry I'm not like cruel to animals I'm literally gonna release them afterward so here we go I'm gonna go downstairs and I'm gonna get a little container and fill it with some soil and dirt so that the worms can like survive and live in there. And also look who's saying hi this morning. What are you doing on this fine morn? She's been like really lovable lately. She always has been, but like extra, extra today because we just got back and she missed us. But first, I need a glass of water. I have not been hydrated today. It's actually not even morning really. It's 11:30, but I got a late start. I just cleaned my room and now I'm ready to be productive. So, first I need to stay hydrated. It's very, very important. Okay, none of this is really dirt. Like that's pine needles. This is grass. Those are stones over there. Um I don't really know. <laughs> There's not much dirt in this neighborhood if you think about it. It's like just grass and cement. Because I'm not about to dig up my yard because my dad would really not be happy. This yard is his pride and joy. And I don't want to ruin it. He works hard on this every day. So maybe I'll just dig up. Right. I'm not going to find a worm, honestly. They're like not just everywhere in the dirt. I'm going to have to go buy some worms. Like live bait worms. But... I could go to PetSmart and get some mealworms, like the little freeze-dried ones they have. You know what I'm talking about? Probably not, but I used to give them to my pet hedgehog, and they have them there, but like... I do think I need to run over to the store, bike over there, because I have to get... Listen to how dumb I am. I went to Target yesterday, and I bought some video supplies. I had to get um, heavy whipping cream because I'm making something. And then I also had to get a Lunchable for a back to school video, you'll see. And what do I do? I bring my Target bag straight upstairs and then I drop it there. And I like this morning I looked in the bag to get something and I realized I left all of the dairy like perishable products in there. So now both of those things are expired. They're like I can't use them or I'm going to get sick. So I have to go to the store and get all new items. I really don't feel like doing that right now. Like, it's so careless. Why didn't I just put them in the fridge? All right, it's time to go to the store now. That's where I'm headed at the very moment. I'm using my backpack. Hopefully you guys are gonna see that in my video that is hopefully gonna be up extremely soon. But I'm gonna grab my bike and we're off. Well, would you look who has a flat tire? Can't really tell right here, but when I'm biking, it's so flat. And honestly, that's just my luck. Like, of course I got a flat tire on the way here. Oh, well, I'll just have to keep on riding until I get to the store. Good stuff. Look who forgot her bike lock. Hopefully it doesn't get stolen. All right, I'm at PetSmart, and look at these cute little birdies. Hi there, buddy. Hi. Oh, they're so cute. But that is not what I'm here for. I'm so sweaty. I'm here for mealworms. Appetizing. Oh, here they are. I came right to them. It was like an instinct in me just told me they were right here. Don't these just look delicious, guys? Um, but these ones, I think, are live and they're $5 cheaper. So I'm going the cheap route and getting live mealworms. All right, I got my mealworms right here and now it's time to go to the grocery store to get some heavy cream so that I can actually make the DIY for my video because this time I won't let it expire. So I am back now. It's been a while since I have updated you and I'm sorry about that. Here's what happened. I, um, after the pet store, I went across the street. I was planning on going to the grocery store, but then I got just a little distracted and I stopped in Francesca's the boutique 
And I was like, you know what? I've been wanting to look in the store for a while. So that's what I did. And I'm going to show you because I did a little bit of damage there. I kind of feel guilty about it. But they're having a huge, huge sale. And I actually need the stuff that I got. So I'm justifying it that way. But I'm going to show you what I got. So the first thing that I got, I got two things. It's not like I got like the whole store. But first thing I got was this dress. I went out of my comfort zone with this dress. I've never worn a maxi dress in my life. Never bought one in my life. So, so today I was like, you know what? I've been wanting to wear one for a long time. I need some dresses for senior year because there are tons of like events and like little ceremonies we have to do. So I thought this would be, maybe be good for that. It's really cute. It's like cinched up here. Is that the word you use? And then it just goes all the way down your feet. So I just thought I really liked the design and it was like half off. So I was really excited about that. And the last thing I got at Francesca's was this headband. Oh my gosh. You guys know I'm obsessed with headbands. I wear them non-stop. So I've actually been needing a new one because I wear the same one every single day. So I got this one. It's like tie-dyed a little bit and you know how I feel about tie-dye. And it's just good to have. And this was also on sale so I just thought it was perfect and I love it. So I decided to try on the dress again because my friend wanted to see it so here it is. I actually really like it. I've never worn a maxi dress. I don't know if I can pull it off. Don't know if it's even cute, but I like it, so that's what matters. I feel so, like, hippie, bohemian in this dress. And it's just, like, really flowy. We are now on set of an upcoming video. Just kidding, it's not really set, but got the ring light there, the camera. I'm using this little $5 tablecloth that I got from Target. Um, and I think around Easter time for a video as a backdrop and I love it I use it all the time so, so I'm about to film making some type of food obviously it's since I'm in the kitchen for an upcoming video it's my last summer video of the year except I kind of have one more but it's not exactly summer related you'll see but it's kind of sad although I am ready to go full gear and back to school so I'm gonna go ahead and start filming and I will do some behind the scenes stuff all right, so I just finished filming a lot of the scenes. Sorry, I didn't really do any behind the scenes, but there were some issues with the memory card. Anyway, it's all good now, but I gotta clean up my mess. And I'm about to get ready for another video. I'm doing the gummy versus real food challenge with my brother, and we're about to film that. So I'm gonna show you guys getting ready for all of it. So I've got all these boxes filled with gummy stuff, and I have this gummy hot dog right here. I had to go searching, like, deep online to find these. Are you ready to see what's inside of this box? Because I am. We've got a waffle, egg, and a piece, two pieces of bacon. So this is going to be a meal. So I already have the real one prepared here, and it smells amazing. Now I have to put the fake ones. Gosh, don't you just love that sweet foul smell of fish. I am using sardines for this and I actually love sardines. Like it's a fact about me. I have always liked them ever since I was a baby. Call me a chef because I cooked up this hot dog. I'm about to fry some bacon and an egg. This is really fun. I'm like cooking in this kitchen and I actually am having a grand old time. Also now my house smells amazing because just whipped up this little pizza right here. I'm just kidding. I literally just heated it up, but still, doesn't that just look amazing? So here I am, future Sophia, back in this clip, but I forgot to end the vlog here, typical me, so it kind of just cuts off, but basically Sam and I just filmed the Gummy vs. Real challenge, and that was it. So if you guys haven't watched that, make sure to go watch it on my main channel. But anyway, thanks for watching this vlog. Hope you guys enjoyed it, even though it was from a few weeks ago. But stay tuned for more vlogs, because I'm about to upload, like, two more since I've not had ch a chance to edit them and I'm hoping to vlog a lot more in these next few weeks before school. So anyway, thanks for watching and I'll see you soon. Bye!